Hola, hola, me escuchan. Hello, hello. Yes, I can hear you, uh, Armando. How are Thank you today? Hi, how's everything? Uh, uh, it's okay, okay. Okay, that's nice, very good. So, something, hello, Ricardo Yoso, Floricia, and Imelda. Hello. How are you today? Hi, Hi teacher. Good Hi. evening. Good evening. So, something you remember about the last class? Algo que recuerden? Something you remember? Any expression, any word about the last week, right? ¿Qué recuerdan de la semana pasada? Study the verbs in the pasado. In simple past, uh -huh. Yes, the verbs in simple past, regulars and irregulars. What else? Algo más? Vocabulary or expressions? Uh -huh. Algo más que se le recuerde sobre la about the last week. Uh -huh. Only that. <laughs> Solamente. Just that. About conversation. And Karina sends a message to the WhatsApp group. It's she said. She, I think she's asking for permission. Okay. Okay, got it, Karina. Okay, hello. Hello. Uh, so, uh, Nelson, algo que recuerde sobre la clase pasada? <laughs> Ese suspiro. Is because you are tired? Is it low? So because it's <laughs> Armando says that you are in love. <laughs> okay. <laughs> in love about your about your wife. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. It's okay. So Armando, something you remember about the last class? I don't remember. <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> about the game. I don't remember. Ah, okay. So the it's very fast. Yes. Okay, they were some fast. Okay, that's nice, very good. And the expression, I send you some information to WhatsApp to the WhatsApp group uh, about um quantifiers. I remember, and also about the simple class, and also about the pronunciation. So when you have time, so check it out, please. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the PowerPoint presentation for today. Just give me a second from eight to nine, right? Here we go. So welcome to the online English program today. So in the general information, right? Right now we are in the session number 10. Okay. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, so, um, so in the session number 10, December 4th. Yeah, we are in December, people. Okay, now general information from Monday to Friday. Now we have the agenda. So in the day 10, we have a greeting, welcome, and general instructions. Review, warm up, attendance, snapshot, conversation, vocabulary, platform exercise. What does she look like? Feedback, closing, and five minutes for advices, right? A specific objective, asking for and getting information, describing appearance, talk about past activities, review, snapshot, and grammar focus. Complete some grammar exercise in the platform and identify activities in familiar scenarios and practice model dialogues for creating personal conversations. That's nice. And what are we doing today? So uh, the participants will be able to review the last session and ask and answer some personal questions about the last class. Participants will be able to describe appearance, practice and create a conversation based in a model dialogue, complete reading exercise and listening exercises. Repeat some vocabulary expressions and complete some exercise in the platform and feedback them, giving information about homework assigned in platform and homework about presentations, right? About <clears throat> the last presentation for Friday was this one, right? About your childhood. And today you're going to talk about your last vacation, right? Your, about your last vacation. Okay. <clears throat> so we are going to move on to the new share about the PDF. So I think it's this. Give me a second, please. 
<clears throat> no, so appearance in, appearance and health is this describe appearance. So you have uh, this information about appearance. Just give me a second, I need to move this. And I want to larger. Okay, you're going to listen the colors. Ah, but I have this activity too. Okay, so uh, so you're going to listen this because I need to wait a moment for, for the rest of the participants. Give me a second, please. Okay, I don't think we are gonna use this. Here we go. Okay, now talking about appearance, right? Adjectives to describe hair. Read and listen. One, black. Two, brown. Three, red. Four, blonde. Five, gray. Six, white. Seven, dark. Eight, light. Nine, straight. Ten, wavy. Eleven, curly. Twelve, long. Thirteen, short. 14. Bald. 15. A mustache. 16. A beard. Okay, so now you listen have, again and repeat. Do you have any question about this vocabulary? Mm -hmm. Everything is clear? Yes? So yes. these ones are uh, hair colors, right? No questions, right? Bow is no hair, right? Bow is no hair. Wavy is like, like this, the hair. When you have a, a wavy hair, it's like when you have a um, like a wave, like a, no curly, no straight. It's in the middle, right? It's between them, okay? More questions? Do you have any questions so far about uh, vocabulary or pronunciation? No, no questions? Okay, so we're gonna move on. So this one is for describing uh, hair, right? For describing appearance. In general, for describing appearance, right? So you have a, a from the dark to the light hair, okay? And so you have a, a, also this one about the length, long shirt and bow, right? And you have a, this information about this, the mustache and the beard, right? Okay. So also you have these parts of the body that you're going to listen. Give me a second. You're going to listen. Page 96, exercise two, vocabulary, the face. Read and listen. One, eye. Two, eyebrow. Three, oh. ear. Eyebrow. Four, nose. Yeah. Five, Eyelashes, six, teeth, seven, mouth, eight, chin, nine, brown eyes, ten, blue eyes, eleven, green eyes, one eyes. tooth, two teeth. Now listen again and repeat. Okay, if you want to repeat. I. 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 Eyebrow. 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 Your nose. 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 Eyelashes. Nose. Eyelashes. 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 Teeth. Eyebrow. Teeth. Chin. Mouth. Mouth, 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 eyes, 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 this. Uh, foot, feet. Uh, eyelashes is this one, right? Eyelashes. The eyelashes. 
And the eyebrow is this one, right? Eyebrow, eyebrow. The chin is this, and that's it, I think. The color is brown, brown, right? Remember, brown, just brown eyes. Okay, do you have any questions so far about pronunciation or vocabulary? Or no questions? Okay, now you're going to listen the descriptions, uh, listening comprehension. Listen to the descriptions, write the number of the, of the conversation in the circle, right? So you have a, a, this person, this person, this person, this person. So how would you describe this person in the first picture? Uh huh. What would you, how would you describe him about the appearance? About the appearance? He has, he is, what? Huh? About the hair. What about the hair? He has what? He has a long hair. Uh, the, the, <laughs> the, the first person or yes. the second? On the first person. Uh, okay, he has short Man. hair. Short. Short. Short hair, right? Okay, short hair, right? Okay, good evening, Carlos, uh, Carlos Alfo Garcia. Uh, uh -huh, he has short hair. Uh, what about this one? How do you say this in English? He has a? Moustache. Moustache. Moustache, right? Moustache. And he is, he is white or he is brunette? Why? Why? I think he's brunette. In, in the middle. <laughs> he is, is kind of white, right? Okay. Now, what about the second person? This person, uh, Armando said that she has long hair. What about the hair? Is curly, is wavy? It's a straight curly. curly. Curly and long, right? Curly and long. She's a colored person, right? She's a colored person. Yeah. Okay, what about the third person? This one. Ah, quizás no me ven la flechita. What about this person, the third one? What, how would you describe him? What does he look like? Mm -hmm. What does he look like? He has short hair. Short hair? What color? What has color? Glasses. He has glasses, excellent, very good. He has a Brown beard. Uh -huh. a, a beard. Uh -huh. A beard. A beard. Very also a beard. A beard. Beard. <clears throat> mm -hmm. And this one? Mustache. Mustache, right? And what about his hair? Is short or long? Short. Short, right? It's gray, right? Gray and black hair. What about the other person? What about she? What does she look like? She's blonde. Mm -hmm. She's blonde. Excellent. Very good, Armando. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. She's blonde. What else? She's young because, because she's not old. She's white. Okay, that's it. Okay. And what about the last one? The last person? About, about her? Uh -huh. How would you describe her? She has glasses. She has glasses. She has short hair. Hair, short. Um, what do you think is blonde or it's brown? <laughs> she has brown hair or she is blonde. 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 She she has like Chinese Chinese <clears throat> uh, eyes, right? I uh, hello. Alguien me llamó, creo. No, nobody called me. Okay, good evening. Hello, hello. Okay, that's nice, very good. So, okay, so you're going to listen, uh, listening comprehension, right? Listen to the descriptions, write the number of, of the conversation in the circle. You're gonna listen, listen the conversation and you have to write, ah, this is, no, this is number one, this is number two, this is number three, this is number four, this is number five, according with the description, according with the description, that you she has white skin okay Ricardo Belloso yes she has white skin right okay you're going to listen and you have to tell me what is the number one what is the number two what is the number three okay. in a moment. Yes, in a moment. page 96 exercise three listening comprehension listen to the descriptions write the number of the conversation in the circle conversation one what does he look like well he has short dark hair and a mustache. Is he good looking? I think so. Conversation two. Number two. What does she look like? Well, she has short, straight gray hair. Is she old? No, 
She isn't very old. Oh, and she wears glasses. Oh. Okay. Number three. Conversation three. What does she look like? She has long, straight hair. What color? Blonde, brown? Blonde. Okay. Number four. Conversation four. What does he look like? He has curly gray hair. Gray hair? Yes, and he has a beard. Oh. Beard, right? Beard. beard. Conversation five. What does she look like? She has long curly hair. Light or dark? She has dark hair, and she's very pretty. Does she wear glasses? No. Okay, now you're going to listen one more time. Now listen again and check your work. Listen again and check your work. Conversation one. What does he look like? Well, he has short dark hair and a mustache. Is he good looking? I think so. Conversation two. What does she look like? Well, she has short, straight gray hair. Is she old? No, she isn't very old. Oh, and she wears glasses. Oh. Conversation three. What does she look like? She has long, straight hair. What color? Blonde, brown? Blonde. Conversation four. Number four. What does he look like? He has curly gray hair. Gray hair? Yes, and he has a beard. Conversation five. What does she look like? She has long curly hair. Light or dark? She has dark hair, and she's very pretty. Does she wear glasses? No. Okay. So, uh, for you, what is the number one? Uh, well, so, yeah. no, mejor this, this one. What number is this? One. He, he, one. Number, one, number one? Yes. yes. Number one. Okay. What about her? What number five. is she? Number five. Five. As Armando said, five. number five. Okay. Now, this one? Four. 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 No. Number three? Two. Two. It's Four. number two. He's number two. And what about she? Three. Half. Uh, yes. She's number three, right? So, he's number three. two. Ya lo vamos a escuchar otra vez. Okay, number three. We're going to listen again. And finally, she? Four. She's number four. Sure? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so she's, he is number one. Let's check it out. Okay, vamos a escucharlo. I'm going to pause it. Page 96, exercise three. Listening comprehension. Listen to the descriptions. Write the number of the conversation in the circle. Conversation one. What does he look like? Well, he has short dark hair and a mustache. Ah, Is he good one. looking? I think so. Mustache, right? Mustache. Good looking. Conversation two. What does she look like? Well, she has short, straight gray hair. Is she old? No, she isn't very old. Oh. And she wears glasses. She. Ah, she. Uh -huh. she. Uh -huh. she. They say she. So it, this one is. Age. Yes. This one. Uh, oops, oops. So this the Chinese one. Chinese face. The Chinese face, right? This one. This yes. Face, number. Yes, number right. two. Two. This one is the number two. Okay. So this También one. El cabello en lacio, teacher. <laughs> okay. No problem. Así dice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, that's nice. So now listen to number three. Conversation three. What does she look like? She has long, straight hair. What color? Blonde, brown? Blonde. Blonde. Okay, number three, yes. So he's number four, right? Conversation yeah. four. What does he look like? He has curly gray hair. Gray hair? Yes, and he has a beard. A uh -huh, beard, Beard, por la barba, beard, es el único. Is the only Conversation one. Conversation five. And yeah. she. What does she look like? She has long curly hair. Light or dark? She has dark hair and she's very pretty. Does she wear glasses? No. Okay, excellent, very good. Okay, that's nice, excellent, very good. So do you have any question about vocabulary or pronunciation? So you have a, this one is a, 
So, um, so you have a um, you have a word that is very similar, right? That is very similar. For example, this one, the pronunciation is beard, beard like this, beard. Okay. Now the other one. Oops. You have also this one, that is bear. The pronunciation is bear. Uh, okay, give me a second. And so you have also a bird. Uh, how do you write it? Like this. Bird. And also you have a, a bird. Bear. Like, like this. Bird. That it's like this. Bird. Bear. Okay, bird is in letter A. Without letter A. So you have a, this one. So uh, you have a beer, you have a bird, you have a beer, and this one has a letter D. And this one is a bird, right? This one is a bird. So do you, uh, is clear what is the difference? Yes. The first one is, the, is this one, right? The bird. It's like this. Okay. And the second one, the bird, the grizzly bird, the panda bear, uh, the black bear, uh, and the other birds, <laughs> the koala bear, and then you have a beer. Examples of beer? Pilsener, right? Pilsener, golden. So those are, are beers. And finally, bird is, is the bird, the animal. Examples of bear are like uh, the eagle, are like uh, the parakeets, are like uh, for example the bear sorry Pajaro loco, no okay <laughs> yes the crazy <laughs> bird right okay like uh, the crazy bird the crazy bird so you have a uh, this one right they are very similar but they are different they are really different and also you have a uh, from birthday from the birthday party birth birthday oops birthday like this birth also, you have a, this one that is like a, a letter F, right? Birth, a strong letter F, birth. That is like a, to, to happy birthday, right? When you have, say happy birthday, also birth is like, a, for example, to have a baby is a birth, okay? So you have a beard, bear, beard, birth, and birth. So they are sure. similar, but they are different, yes? Stephanie dice que la sacó Zoom de la clase. Ah, sorry, sorry, sorry. I haven't checked him. Punish him. ¿A quién? Pichame. Ok, Armando, it's ok. Uh, ok. She has white skin, Ricardo Belloso, very good. Ok, Armando, no problem, it's ok. Eh, punish him. ¿A quién, Diana? <laughs> punish him to Armando. <laughs> the internet. Ah, to the internet. Ok, so that's nice. Okay, so, uh, okay, Armando, I understand, no problem, it's okay. So, uh, in, you said in the chat, in the chat me lo pusieron. Okay, let me check it out. Yes, Mari Wendy, yes, she's going to be a listener, I think. Okay, it's okay. So, so you have a, this pronunciation that are different. Do you have any questions so far about vocabulary or pronunciation? Questions? Okay, no questions, yes? No. Okay, we are gonna move to this activity. In this activity, so you have, a, it's a game. Era el primero que íbamos a hacer, pero it was the first to do it. Pero no sé si lo ven. A ver, déjeme ver. I don't know if you can see it. I think yes. Okay. Give me a second. Now, can you see the handman? Can you see it? Adjectives of feeling, it says. Choose the letters and guess the missing word. Can you see it or you cannot see it? No. You cannot. Ah, it's in, it's in another side. It's in another side. And now, you can see it? Yes. No, yes. You are terrible, it says. Ah, okay. Okay, Armando. So, a uh, clue. The clue is she's very because her team won the game. What do you think is the word here that has two, three, four, five, five letters? You're gonna tell me a letter, right? You're gonna tell me a letter. Happy. <laughs> yes. Okay, very <laughs> okay. Happy. Let's check it out. Happy. Happy. 
Yes, it's correct. She's very happy because uh, they want, the, her team want. Okay, they are very about their snowboarding trip. And so you have a, this, remember, adjectives of feeling. So you have a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's, uh, the girls start, okay? Point for the boys and the girls start. Okay, girls, a letter or the word? B, teacher. Letter B, uh, like this? Yes. B as a bird, okay? Okay, no, no letter B. Okay, boys? Yeah, letter A. Letter A, this one, right? No, no letter A. Incredible, but it doesn't have letter A. Okay, this e? uh, letter A, yeah, yeah, Ricardo. Letter E, e? Like, is, like E, like elephant, right? Yes. Okay, yes, two letter E. Okay, adjectives of feeling, remember. Okay, boys. The boys turn, the men. L. L. Es el turno de los chicos, pero vamos a ver. No, no letter L. Is my treasure. M. 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 No. No M. H. 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 X. What letter? X. 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 Yes. Yes. So what is, what is the word? <laughs> sí. Okay. What are you laughing? Letter C, teacher. Letter C. Okay. And the voice, what happened with the voice? Excellent. Excellent. No, it's not excellent. The excited. Excited. Boy for the girls. Excited, right? Excited. Excited is like a... No es excitado. Es emocionado. Right? Now, it is still raining. No. And really, and really, it's still raining. And really, and you have uh, five spaces. Uh, the girls start because they want. Ah, uh, uh, no le da bien la imagen, Marie. Sorry, es, es la señal. Okay. Can you see it very well, this? Can you see the, the keyboard and the game very well? Can you read the sentence? Hey, what, what adjective is? Adjectives of feeling. Is it still raining? And uh, really? Oh. One, two, three, Thank four, you. five. What is it? Enjoy. Enjoy. It has a letter E, but no letter N. So it's not enjoy. <laughs> okay. Girls? Woman? Letter A. Letter? A. 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 This one. No. Yes. No, it has a letter oh. I'm Sorry. Okay. Boys? O. N. O. Oh, no. No letter O. Sorry, boys. Mm. Girls. What about girls? Huh? Oh, sorry, L. I can hear you. Hello. L. L, M. L, right? Ah, uh, Mary Wendy sends a picture. Ah, uh, yes, sorry. Sorry, Mary Wendy. Tired, uh, teacher? Tired. It's not. It's not tired. But if not, the letter T, it will be at the beginning. So it's not tired. Mm -hmm. It's a friend. What? What? Our teacher. Sorry? R. R. R, letter R. Let me check it out. R? No. Letter C? Letter C. No. <laughs> uno a uno. Yes, you are one to one. One to letter one. C. One uh, mm -hmm. one to one. So letter C. E? So, but thing is raining. And really? D. E? Sorry? D. Letter B. Letter, letter B. No. D. Ah, uh, letter D. Uh, letter D. Yes. This as a dad. No, letter D. No. Okay, what oh. is the word? On another one. The letter, the keys in leather in red. They are what? They are. They are what? L. Sorry. Oh. L. L. Oh, no, no les oigo bien. L. 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 No. En F. No. F. No, F. No. Huh? M. 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 <laughs> <That's it. laughs> All the alphabet. <laughs> you are not going to guess the word. So, another letter? B. Letter B. ¿Para cuál B? Gracias. B. Huh? 
La grande, B grande, B. Ok, B, de B. No, B as big, no. Mm. S. 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 True. Ok. P, teacher. Letter? P. P. P as a potato. Yes. Ok. And the other one. What is the word? I, what is the word? La, a, 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 but A is already taken. A, a, a. No. U. A, no. La U, la U, la U, la U. U. Upset. U. Upset. upset. Molesto, upset. right? Upset. I'm really upset. Uh -huh. This movie isn't very good. Upset. Uh, I'm... So this the upset. movie is... Molesto, molesto. Yes. This movie... Now, the next one. This movie isn't very good. I'm so when you have a five five letters. So tell me, start the voice. T. T as a tomato. T yes. as a tomato? Yes. Yes. No. Girl. B. H. A. B. 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 H. B. 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 grande, B. grande, B. grande, B. grande. El B. Grande. Chica, creo. One by one, teacher. B. B. H. H. Dijeron las chicas. Va ahora los boys. Boring. 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 Okay, boring. Let's check it out. Boring. No, uh, boring. It's similar to boring. No. Boring. Boring. E-D. Boring. This movie is a very good board. Okay, point for the girls or for the boys? Oh, uh, one and one. No, ya llevamos cuatro, teacher. No, la, la anterior nadie la vino. Nobody gets the last one. Two and woman one. Ajá, you, no, you were one and one. Las dos primeras la adivinamos nosotras y esta tres. No, I, I, I'm saying the first. Happy. Sí, Armando ha adivinado la primera. Eh, so, uh, the number two, the girls. The number two. three, nobody. And the number, the last one, who gets the last one? ¿Quién adivina Me. la anterior? Yes. Me. Yes. Girls. Okay, Maria Wendy, sorry. Okay, now she is because her friend moved to another city. So. 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 Right. So. Right. So. 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 Es. Le, yes, right, sad. It's letters. Know, it's sad. sad. Okay. Nah. Sad. Now, the, I think it's the last one. And really, because I was out last night. And really, mm, mm. because I was out last night. So you have a five letters. Okay. Happy. It's happy. Okay. Girls, third. No, it's not happy. Boys. Tire. Tire. Tire de cansado. No, tire. Cansado. Tired. Okay. Okay, let's check it out. Yes, tired, correct. Okay, it's the second for Armando. Okay, David was very, was very in pass about his exam. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven letters. The girls start. Girls? Excellent. Excellent, exhausted. Oh, the letter U, the girls. No, no, exhausted because doesn't have the letter U. Difficult. Boys? Difficult. Difficult. David was very difficult. He was very difficult. No, no. The exam maybe it could be difficult, but the David no. David was very exhausted. Exhausted. Exhausted has the letter U. Has has a letter U. Let's see. Has a letter E. Yes. Okay, girls. Because the boys said the letter E, right? So the girls. Letter A. Letter A. No letter A. Boys. Boys, boys. Letter D. Letter D. Yes. Okay. 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 Now, girls. O. O. Yes. Boys. Letter T. Letter T. No. Letter T. No. Girls. Letter C. Letter C. No. Boys, board, board, no, no, doesn't match, the, the spaces doesn't match, 
They don't match. W. 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 Okay. What is the word? Work ethic. No. Work ethic. No. Work. No. Work. No. What? What is? Worried, worried. Yes, Nelson, Nelson get it, right? Ah. So worried. <laughs> my, hey, the last one. My parents, my parents are really because I didn't like work me. for my exam. I didn't work for my exam. My parents are really because one, two, three, four, five. Uh, start the girls. Girls? The girls, girls, girls? Angry? Angry. Okay, let's see it out. Yes, angry. Okay, very good. Okay. I think was a tie. Was a tie, right? Was a tie. Right? Oh no, was not a tie. No. I think it was a tie. Okay, so uh, we're gonna continue with the class. <laughs> I think it was a tie. Teacher, yes. there's one. <laughs> It could be, maybe. No, I think it was a tie. It was not a tie. No yes. Problem. Yes or no? So, for remember, <laughs> for describing, okay, we're going to come back to the class. Describing people with be and have, right? With be, so you have a, her eyes are blue. I don't know if you can see it. Lo ven bien. Can you see it very well? Or oh. it's Larry? <laughs> Larry, for you, okay, you can see it very well. Very well. Okay. okay, her eyes are blue. Their hair is gray, right? Using the bird to be. Her eyelashes, this one, her eyelashes are long and dark. With have, she has blue eyes. They have gray hair. She has long, dark eyelashes, right? Okay, so additives come before the nouns. They describe. She has blue eyes. No, she has eyes blue, right? Adjectives are never plural. Never, never are plural. She has blue eyes. No, she has bluest eyes. So you, bluest doesn't exist. Her eyes are blue. No, her eyes are blues. Now, you're going to listen uh, this conversation. Well, you're going to listen the conversation, and you're going to tell me what you listen. Okay? Here, here we go. Page 97. Now you can describe appearance. Exercise 1. Conversation model. Read and listen. Listen, listen. Yes, Who's please. that? She looks familiar. Who? The woman with the long, dark hair. Oh, that's Yvette Sangalo. She's a singer from Brazil. No kidding. Okay, what did you listen? Long Any word? Uh-huh. Yes, what else? Yes, from Brazil. Okay, from Brazil. Yes, what else? Something else? The rest of the class? What did you listen? Something you listen? Do you want to listen again? The long, uh, long time. Okay, let, let's check it out again. Page 97. Now you can describe appearance. Exercise one. Conversation model. Read and listen. Who's that? She looks familiar. Who? The woman with the long, dark hair. Oh, that's Yvette Sangalo. She's a singer from Brazil. No kidding. Okay. What else did you listen? Can, what else? Something else? Long black hair. Uh -huh. Long dark hair. Long dark hair. Okay, black hair. What else? It's for describing appearance, right? Okay, now you're going to listen and you're going to read it. Listen and read it. Page 97. Now you can describe appearance. It's Sangalo. Exercise one. Here from Brazil. Conversation model. Read and listen. Who's that? She looks familiar. Who? The woman with the long, dark hair. Oh, that's Yvette Sangalo. She's a singer from Brazil. No kidding. No kidding, right? No kidding. Who's that? She looks familiar. Who? The woman with long, dark hair. Oh, that's Yvette Sangalo. She's a singer from Brazil. No kidding. Now you're going to listen and repeat. Listen and repeat. Page 97. Exercise 2. Rhythm and intonation. Listen again and repeat. Then practice the conversation model with a partner. Who's that? She looks familiar. Who's that? She looks familiar. You have to repeat it, right? Who? Who's that? Who? She looks familiar. The woman Who's with that? She looks familiar. 
Okay. The woman with the long dark hair. Oh, that's it. That's Sangalo. The woman with the long singer dark hair. Brazil. Hmm? Oh, that's it. It's Sangalo. She's a singer Sangalo. from Brazil. From Brazil. Sangalo. Oh, that's it. Sangalo. Hmm? No kidding. Okay, repeat that for me. Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? She looks that's... familiar. She looks familiar. Who? 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 The woman with the long dark hair. The woman with the long dark hair. Hair, hair. 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 hair, right? Uh, <clears throat> oh, that's Ivet Sangalo. Oh, that's Ivet oh, Sangalo. That's Ivet Sangalo. She's a singer from Brazil. She's, She's a, a singer from Brazil. 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 No kidding. No, no kidding. kidding. Okay, now you're going to tell me uh, the same conversation, but you have to change this information. You're going to change the information about uh, if it is a man, right? So you are going to say he or she. If it is uh, uh, also the name, the man or the woman, uh, also the description about the hair, the description of the hair, sorry, the description of the hair, long or dark or brown, and the name, of course, the name, you are going to say another name about this one. Who Hi. can you see in the picture? What people, who singers, who actors can you see in the people? Here, can you see here in the pictures? Uh -huh. Who can you see it? Uh -huh. Who are who are they? Yvette Sangalo. Uh -huh. Yvette Sangalo is a singer from Brazil. The other person who is? Andrea Bocelli. Andrea Bocelli is a what does he do? Singer. 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 He's a singer from Italy, right? He's a singer from Italy. Italy. What about G Gerard de Pardieu? Gerard de Pardieu? Okay. Is an actor, actor, French. actor from France, right? Okay. So you have a the next one. The, the woman is who is the woman? Julia Roberts. Julia Roberts. She's a actress. An actress from the U.S. From the U.S. And I am paid. Who's I am paid? Architect. Architect from China. Architect from China. From China. Yes. China. Yes, now what are you gonna, you are gonna complete here the spaces and you're gonna tell me a conversation, okay? So, but maybe for tomorrow, because it's, it's kind of late and we have many things to do. Okay, I need to, to, to take advantage of the, of, the, of the manual. Yes, I'm gonna send it to the group and, and for tomorrow you're gonna tell me this conversation, okay? So right now I remember that we have a presentation <laughs> so a presentation about your last vacation, right? In yes. Second. Yes. Now uh, the presentation about your last vacation. So for tomorrow, this is going to be this, hung, this conversation. This con similar to this conversation model, you're going to talk about another person. So you can choose from these people or you can choose other actor or your favorite actor, your favorite singer, your favorite soccer player, who, whoever you want, okay? Is clear what are you going to do for tomorrow? Yes. Yes. A conversation similar to this one, but for for other person, for other famous person, okay? For tomorrow, similar to this conversation. It is individual. It's going to be individual. Only you. You and God. <laughs> okay? So, okay. Okay, so uh, today we have a... Uh, um, in the unit, so today we started the unit number nine. What does he? What does what does she look like? Right? What does she look like? This one you can pronounce this as a letter D. Okay, this one. Oops. This one you can pronounce as a letter D. These two words. Okay. What does she look like? Right? Or what does he look like? So you have the same. The hair, long brown hair, short blonde hair. Uh, you have uh, also a straight black hair. This is from your manuals. Curly red hair, bold, bold, no hair, <laughs> a mustache and beard. You have about the age, young, middle age, elderly. You have about the looks, handsome, good looking, and pretty. Do you have any question with vocabulary? Good looking is like, so this one is good looking. 
So look, uh, good looking is a synonym for for handsome or pretty. As handsome or pretty is a synonym for a uh, good looking. Pretty is only for girls, and handsome is only for boys. Beautiful is for for girls and for audience. Beautiful, and so you have a, about the, <clears throat> the about the height. So you have a short, fairly short, the medium in the middle between medium height, pretty tall, and very tall, right? So do you have any question with vocabulary or pronunciation? Do you have any question? No, teacher. Okay, Armando says, ah, Armando lo sacó. Armando, are you in the inside? Are you, me, no me deja entrar, me sacó de la clase, it's okay. Okay, Armando, uh, Armando is inside. Let me figure out. Armando said that soon took him out. Okay, so, uh, okay, so no question with vocabulary, right? No questions about vocabulary. Okay, that's nice. So you have a, a, a this one, this exercise about your last vacation, to talk about your last vacation. Qué raro, Armando. Armando no me escucha. Okay, creo que ya lo pasé. Give me a second, Armando. I'm gonna help you. I'm gonna try to help you. Uh, so you're going to talk about your last vacation, about about what did you do, or this one is about the the last the previous unit. For example, you have a writing in an in online post. Read this online post, similar to this one, right? So write an online post to a partner about your last vacation. Then exchange miss Well, that that's it. Uh, Chichen Itza, greetings from Cancun. I'm having a great time. Yesterday, I took a tour to the Mayan rims of Chichen Itza. They were amazing. This morning, I went to the beach and then went shopping in the city. I bought some beautiful Mexican sil silver jewelry. Last night, I tried the famous local lime soup. This was a great vacation. So uh, volunteer to read your last vacation. Teacher, huh? yes. on my on my last vacation, I didn't do anything hmm. Be, hmm. because my mom was sick. Okay, your mom was. Sick. But this year I will. This year, uh, I will go to Guatemala. Oh, that's nice. Okay, okay, that's nice. Very good. What would you like? To, what place would you like to visit in Guatemala, Diane? Ah, uh, Panajachel. Ah, Panajachel. Why? It's nice. It's uh, interesting. Exciting. The people says uh, it's amazing. Uh, the place. Mm -hmm. And I wanna, I wanna know. Okay. Yes. Excellent. Very good. I would like to go to. <laughs> That's nice. Very good. Okay. Excellent. So Armando said, "Oh, uh, right now, teacher. Okay. That's nice. Very good. Thank you, Diane. Somebody else." Ah, uh, somebody sent the la the first com the first presentation, right? Carlo Garcia, can you hear me? I'm gonna talk about your childhood. You said Carlos Garcia, hello. Hello, Carlos. Well, okay, it's okay. Carlos Garcia sent a message. Uh, thank you, teacher. I'm gonna talk about me as a child, about the childhood. I was a dreamer and shy. I was heavy and fairly short. My hair was black and curly. My favorite TV program was the Flintstones. My favorite hobby was to ride my bike with my sister. Okay, thank you, Carlos Garcia. Another person to talk about your last vacation? Uh, ah, so you, yes. you have the L, right, Carlos? So you are listening, okay? Me, teacher. Okay, go ahead, please. On my last vacation, I went to the beach with my family and some friends. We explore a beach known for its, its few waves and the weather was very comfortable despite the beach being crowded due to the vacation days. Mm -hmm. We still ha had a lot of fun. We listened to music, ate delicious food, and I bought some sunglasses. I had um, I 
a hat and a few bracelets. Overall, we had a great, a great time. Um, bracelets, bracelets. Uh, yeah. bracelets. Okay, bracelets. Very good. Thank you, Elsa Noelia. Somebody else who wants to talk? I don't know. Uh, somebody else? Huh? Who can talk? Well, I don't know. Who else can talk? I don't know, Nelson or Ricardo, about your last vacation or tomorrow? Okay, teacher. Okay, Nelson, go ahead, please. I'm going to tell you what I did on my vacation. Uh -huh. on, my, on my vacation, I always dedicate time to the family mm -hmm. to go out uh -huh. to the beach. Then we visit my parents who live in Sultan. Uh -huh. okay. Finally, finally, I went swimming at Lake Ilopango and the Amapulapa Tourist Center. Mm -hmm. I like oh. it a lot. Okay, okay, that's nice, very good. Thank you, thank you, that's very good. Okay, somebody else? Uh -huh, somebody else? So, Diana already passed, Elson already passed, Nelson already passed. Me, teacher. Okay, Aníbal, go ahead. Okay, on my vacation, I went to the beach with my friend. We went to enjoy some city. Then I spent a rest at home to wait for the return to work. Mm -hmm. Okay, to come back. And then the return is come back. Okay, return okay. is too much formal. Uh -huh. okay. so, and you say we went and enjoyed. We went and enjoyed. Letter D. E D. We went and enjoyed. Okay. okay. Oh, very good. Thank you, Anibal. Somebody else? Somebody else? Somebody else? Oh, hello. Me, teacher. Okay, Ingrid Smeralda. Okay. My amazing vacation. I went white. With my family to the beach, mm -hmm. we got fun and we had, we ate a lot of delicious food. Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, we went to eat pupusas to Olocuilta. It was a really good day. Okay, excellent, very good, Ingrid. Thank you so much. It was a really good day. Thank you. Nice. Somebody else? Me. Okay, Diana. Yes. Diana Stephanie, right? Yes. And I went to the beach and I took a lot of pictures with my friends. And I ate seafood in popular restaurant in the beach. And at night I I danced at Tunco Beach. And that's it. Okay, yes, I took a lot of pictures, right? I took a lot of pictures. That's nice. Thank you, Diana Stephanie. Thank you so much. Okay, somebody else or for tomorrow, the rest? Hello, hello, the rest is going to be for tomorrow. Hello, hello. Somebody else? Okay, so we are gonna put the rest for tomorrow, then. Okay, so we are gonna continue with the manual. Yes? Okay, give me a second. Uh, this is Aníbal. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. So, uh, yes, uh -huh. uh, somebody sent this. Uh, oh, this is the homework that you are asking for, right? About this. Let me see. Where is it? No, it's here. Here. Uh, give me a moment. So, the homework that Aníbal is saying is about this. In a second. Is this about your childhood? Carlos Garcia sent it to the WhatsApp group and I read it because he is just a listener today. So, uh -huh. I don't know if there is another person. Varios pasaron. Ahí los tengo anotados. No sé si hay alguien más que vaya a pasar. About, this one was about Friday, right? About Friday, some of you read it, and so uh, some of you are missing, are still missing. Mm -hmm. I don't know if 
Anybody else is going to read it? Can you see it? Can you see it very well? Ah, hello, hello. Hey, for the people who didn't pass on Friday. I come back. Yes? Oh. Huh? Who, somebody is, else is going to pass today about this? About your childhood? Or about the about the other presentation that you had about you? Yeah, Armando. About... <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> yeah, Armando okay, it's about... Okay. Your last vacation, Armando. <laughs> Who's talking? Can you tell? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Mira, yo no, yo no quería decir. No, no, okay. On my last vacation, I went to visit my daughter, my father, my, my sisters. I went to uh, Salpatitán, Nahuizalco. Really? Yes. Okay. Oh. And, and what did you do there? What did you uh, do? I'm born in Huayua. I was born, yeah, okay. Okay. Ah, really, in Huayua, Huayua. Was born. There is uh, uh, the, La Ruta de las Flores. Ah, okay, really. Oh, nice. Yes. It's a nice place. Okay, yes. yes. Very good. I was born. I was born I was in Huayua. Yes. I went to visit. I went, I went to visit. Excellent. Very good, Armando. That's nice. Thank you so much, Armando. Okay. So, uh, the rest is going to be for tomorrow. <laughs> oh, is there anybody else who wants to pass? Hello, hello. Oh, well, tomorrow, right? So, it's okay. Don't worry. Okay, so, uh, right now we are here in the manual. So, you're going to listen to the conversation. Okay, you're going to listen to this conversation in these 10 minutes. Okay, that's nice, very good. Okay, here you're gonna listen this, and you're gonna tell me what you listen, right? So to, we were talking about a description, right? What does she look like? What, what does he look like? Diana is laughing. <laughs> I don't know why she's laughing. Okay, so you're gonna listen the conversation about unit number nine. So right now you're going to see dark, because I'm looking for the audio. Give me, a, give me a moment, please. Give me a moment. Diane, what, what are you like? <laughs> okay, now listen. Unit 9. Can you listen? What does she look like? Yes. Page 59, exercise 2, conversation. She's very tall. Part A, listen and practice. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name's Ashley, and she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two. What did you listen? Sorry, I, I, el, el, el uh, talking about the very tall. Uh huh. Yes, yes. Very tall. They are talking about what? You are talking about about girlfriend or the girlfriend. Yes. Okay. Continue listening. Sorry to. Do I suppose? Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay. What else did you listen at the end? Something else you listen at the end? Three for her. Okay, yes, he is, it says. So Aníbal, the classmate, Castro, it, it says a letter S. Yes, he is. Okay. So I don't know what are you talking about. So what, at the end, what did you listen? What else did you listen? Or do you want to listen again? Yes? Okay, we're going to listen again. Okay, don't worry about it. Unit 9. What does she look like? Page 59, exercise 2, conversation. She's very tall. Part A, listen and practice. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name's Ashley, and she's gorgeous. Really? 
What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, what are they talking about? Who are the people talking about? Where are they? So, uh huh. What did you they listen? Red hair. She has red hair. Uh -huh, the girlfriend, maybe, right? He uh, don't what? have the age of he of she. Uh huh. He doesn't know the age. Her age. He doesn't know her age. Very good, Armando. Somebody else. She's very tall. She's very tall. She's very tall, right? Very tall. He will have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes. Ah, uh -huh, yes, right. Exactly. Okay, and she's jerk. excellent. Very good. Now you're gonna listen the conversation. You're gonna read and listen. Read and listen. Can you see the conversation very well, or it's blurry? It's blurry, or no? Now listen. Can you read it? Can Unit read it? nine. What does she look like? Page 59, exercise two, conversation. She's very tall. Part A, listen and practice. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name's Ashley and she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, now, do you have any questions with vocabulary? Questions with vocabulary? Okay, gorgeous is a synonym for very, very beautiful. Gorgeous is a synonym for very, when the person is the girl or the boy is really, really beautiful. That's gorgeous. Do you have more questions about vocabulary or pronunciation? Okay, no, no more questions. Something that is not clear in the conversation? Okay, no, it's okay, everything is okay? Okay, I'm gonna pass the attendance. So read the conversation and you're gonna let me know if you have any questions. Ana Graciela Ramos, present. Ana Graciela Ramos Garcia, Ramos Garcia. Okay. Anderson Jeremy Molina Celaya. Anderson. Anderson. Andrea Maria Franco Rivas. Did you list right? Yes. Andrea Maria Franco Rivas. Armando Antonio Albanes. Albanes. Martinez. Okay. Blanca Stephanie Vázquez Hernández. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Karina Beatriz Nuñez. El micrófono se me había escondido. Okay, no problem. Carlos Adolfo García. Ah, Carlos Adolfo García Crespo, no. Carlos Aníbal. Ah, Carlos Adolfo present, right? In the chat, right? He's, he said present, Carlos Adolfo. Carlos Aníbal, he said here, right? Daniela okay. Alejandra Martinez. Okay, Anderson, Jeremy present in the chat. Yes, gorgeous is a synonym for fantastic, really, 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 extremely beautiful, extremely handsome, extremely pretty, gorgeous. Yes. Now, um, Daniela Alejandra Martinez Molina, Diana Stephanie Salmerón Hernández. I'm here. Okay, okay, Carlos. Okay, uh, Diana Patricia Carranza. Present teacher. Okay, Elsa Noelia Portillo Chacón. I'm here. Enma Débora. Floricia Mengibar Vigil. Present. Okay. Enma, present, right? Enma and Floricia, present. Henry Alexander Hidalgo. Henry Alexander Hidalgo Rivas. Ingrid Esmeralda Cornejo Osorio. Present. Jaime Iván Ventura. Jaime yeah, Iván. Ok, Karina Yamilet González. Carla Gabriela García de Avendaño. Carla Present. Gabriela. María Imel. Okay. Present Mari. teacher. Ok, Mari Wendy is in the chat, right? Present the... teacher. Ok, Marisol de Los Ángeles Cortés. Present teacher. Ok, Mauricio Alberto. Ok, 
Ah, who said about Friday's homework? Ok, Maurice Alberto. Nelson Rutilio. Present teacher. Ricardo Belloso is in the chat, right? Pres present teacher, present. Ok, Ricardo Belloso. Ronald Alexander Rodríguez. Present teacher. Ok, Rosa Elizabeth Barrientos. Rosa. Present. Ruth Noemi. Present. Tamar Alexandra Portillo Melara. Tamar. Ok, so, oops, I closed it. Uh, ok, so, uh, I'm going to send it. Tomorrow we're going to continue with the unique number nine, talking about um, description about appearance, which at present, Rosa Elizabeth. Ok, ok, Rosa Elizabeth. And so, uh, tomorrow. Here, teacher. Who, who said? Henry. Ah, ok, Henry. Henry. Ok, thank you, Armando. So, tomorrow we're going to continue. And so, the people who didn't present uh, to talk about your last vocation, the presentation. So, tomorrow you can do it, right? Or about your childhood. Okay, thank you. Okay, uh, Henry Alexander Rivas says, thank you, Armando. So, and I'm gonna send you some expressions for um, for writing two sentences for tomorrow, okay? But later on, I'm gonna send them. So I have to move to the other group. So thank you for joining today. See you tomorrow, okay? Bye-bye, have a good night. See Take you, care. teacher. Bye. See you tomorrow. Good night. Tomorrow. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Good night. Good night, good night people, good night. Hi, Carlos. Good night, people from the chat. Take care, people. Okay. Bye, teacher. Good night. Uh, see you tomorrow. Good night, Henry. Good night, Carlos. Good night, Armando. Good night. Bye-bye. Okay. See you tomorrow.